Hi guys, I'm Lenny. <laughs> <laughs> that was your cue. <laughs> After I say Lenny. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Lenny. I'm and we're from Jungle Scout. Welcome today to the very next Jungle Product Challenge. And for anyone that didn't see our first product challenge, basically uh, Lenny here has five minutes to choose a product that you think's got good potential to sell on Amazon using our Jungle Scout web app, looking at a particular marketplace with certain filters. And as I've found before, that is no easy thing to do. So uh, I'm, I'm very interested to hear, Becky, what marketplace and filters do you have for me? So your filters today have been very kindly recommended by Hitesh, who commented Thanks on our Hitesh. video, so thank you, it's awesome. Today, we're gonna have a look at the India market. Mm -hmm. And your minimum price is 800 rupees, which okay. is approximately 12 and a half dollars. Um, your minimum sales is 100 units per month, and your max reviews is 100. Okay. So, those sound so get on. Yeah, I'm just going to put a little disclaimer out there that I'm really not familiar with the India market or really what. Yeah, I'm just a total noob. I don't know what sort of products to expect. Uh, so this is going to be interesting for me, for sure. So uh, yeah, I'm just going to be having let's, fun. Let's let's just let's just do it, okay? <laughs> Five minutes on the clock. Okay, you, I'm ready. Are you prepared? I'm prepared. Yeah, I'm ready? in the zone, yeah, ready, ready to go. Let's emotions. do this. Right, let's do five, it. Four, <gasps> All right. Three, two, one. Oh no. Okay. Two. Cool. Okay, guys. So. What I'm going to do initially is I'm just going to open up anything that just sort of looks interesting to me. So flood outdoor lights. Lights are usually can be quite good. It's going to be really hard to judge the price because I have no, I you know, it, it's hard to, to know the price, but I at least know it's more than a minimum, which is a start. The reviews look fairly low. Uh, the sales look okay. So I'm just going to open up a flood outdoor light. Um, blue luggage set. Uh, that, that sounds good. It sounds simple, not electronic, easy to make. One downside potentially is that it could be oversized, but otherwise uh, I might open that one up. What do you think of luggage, Becky? Yeah, well, I know that I need to send these back. I've been super blue in mine to get them out for the past six months. <laughs> you, you probably wouldn't get it from India, though, I'm, I'm assuming, but... No, no, I, I tried to get it in Thailand, but... Um, yeah. Yeah, mine's, mine's on its last legs. Ah, oh, nice, yeah. I'll let you know if, if we end up selling this one. <laughs> yeah, definitely let me know. Uh, um, let's go. Grass-fed ghee, that's something I like, but that's a food product, so we'll, we'll leave that one. Um, it's good. Foldable mosquito nets, let's open that one up. It's a simple product, it would probably fold down nice and small. Um, they're, they're good, yeah, definitely uh, uh, around here. Stainless steel pop-up toaster. Bit too electronic. Storage water heater, electronic. Um, wall hanging thing. Uh, looks small, simple. We might go with that. ActiveX Australia. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oh, you know that? Wow. Okay. I don't even, yeah, anyway. Um, <laughs> luggage bag. Uh, again, that could be oversized, but I like that it's nice and simple. I'd say it's fairly easy to manufacture. Okay, what do we got? Cotton Comfort, Cotton Comfort, Cotton King Size Bed Sheet. Oh, I have an obsession with um, Okay, well, let's let's open that one up. Okay, cool, thanks for that. Comforter. Hmm, I'm just trying to think what I think about comforters and, and dunas and, and things. I guess they're all right. They, I suppose it depends how, how big they are. I know they can be quite big. Yeah. Might be oversized, but um, okay, let's go to page two. I'm just gonna open up maybe one or two more things. You're and then, way. okay, I'm running out of time. I'm Okay, I guess gotta like, zone in. zone in. Okay, photo frames, set of 11, good sales. Um, only 10 reviews, that's kind of good. Maybe a set of 11 might be too many, that might make it too big, but maybe there's an option to sell just individual ones or maybe like a two, three, four pack. Shin guards. That sounds kind of interesting. I'm going to open that one up and leave it at that. So the next step is I want to analyze the entire niche to make sure it's not just this one um, this one listing. Two minutes. Two minutes. Thank you so much, Becky. So <laughs> let's uh, look at LED flood outdoor light. So I'm just going to start typing that in LED flood. Um, Floodlight outdoor. So I'm going to use Amazon's recommendations here to find the most popular keywords. Okay. 
So that will give me the best idea of this niche. Now the thing that I want to look at is how much competition is in the, the uh, top sort of 10 or results. Um, one, two, three, so yeah, no, super quick guys, just a little shameless plug there for Jungle Scout. <laughs> so um, it looks like uh, the, the reviews are pretty low, which is good. The sales, um, this one's got 167. These all look very low though, which is kind of a shame. So that alone, I would probably um, rule that out. The price, um, what was it, 800 rupees? Mm -hmm. Some of these are a little bit lower, so I'm just gonna probably say no to that one for now for those okay, reasons. Luggage and bags. Um, okay, so we're gonna leave out the blue and just kind of go luggage, luggage set. It looks like luggage set three piece is popular. I'm gonna run the extension on this one. And what, come on internet, quicker. <laughs> reviews so far, unless they're still loading. Looks like really, really low reviews. Oh, the sales are already really low. I could have got the wrong, um, I might have the wrong keyword there, but I'm just gonna leave that one for now. But I am interested in this one, foldable mosquito net. Because it's very, um, foldable mosquito net. Yeah, I'm, I've got my fingers crossed for this one because it's very simple and easy. And if you can get, you know, a good profit margin on this, low competition. Okay, maybe other people have had the same idea, unfortunately. It looks <laughs> like there's a lot of competition, nearly 600 reviews, 300, 700. So starting to look competitive. We haven't got all the sales data. I'm gonna leave that one, even though I liked it, this one. I don't know what to search for. Polyester bags. That spreadsheet. And I, oh, I don't know. I didn't get anything. All right, so that proved quite hard to, to yeah. find a product in five minutes. I did get a few ideas out there uh, at least. So what I reckon we should do now is like take a bit of a closer look into each one mm. and just see if I did happen to have anything. So looking at luggage bag, um, I'm not really sure about any of these keywords. I was hoping to be a little bit more broad. So maybe I'll just look up luggage bag. Not fancy in women's stylish bag. It's, it's not my thing <laughs> to be, to be fair. In luggage bags, we've got, uh, for the reviews, there's one here with 225, which is a little bit higher, but it's not too bad. Uh, there's another one here with two, nearly 300 reviews. But other than that, in sort of the top 10, it looks like it's not too competitive. A mm. uh, hundred is a sign of, of good sales. It looks like mm. there is quite a bit of demand. It's a little bit worrying that this number one listing has 900 reviews, yeah. uh, sorry, <clears throat> 900 sales, but um, there's not too many others that get close. This one's got 800. Yeah. Um, so I'd, I'd usually like to see the sales fairly well spread out. However, this one's not too bad because there is this one here with like 300, this one with nearly 500, 500, 300. So actually, yeah, upon looking at that, it is fairly well spread out. So um, there is plenty of demand here um, per month. So I actually quite like that. As, I, as we said, the competition's pretty good. And um, then if we look at the prices for this product, uh, we we were looking for at least 800. 800. Yeah, so they all... So, uh, some of them are a little bit lower here. Yeah. Um, oh, the one that's getting a, like 900 sales looks to be a, like considerably cheaper. But then we've got... Oh, it's it's kind of hard to, to tell. Yeah. The good thing here is that you can see kind of the average price up here is 2,500 rupees, which is well above what we wanted. Mm. So it mightn't actually be too bad. At, at this point, I don't mind this product. Uh, also, the other cool thing with the extension is that it gives us this yeah, little score. opportunity score up the top, and it's got a seven, which is like pretty decent. Medium demand with low competition, so um, at this Did point, yeah, I'd, uh, I'd put that one to the side at the moment. I, I quite like it. So cool. let's jump over to the next thing that I had. I'll just go king size bed yeah. sheet. We'll keep it really broad, and we'll see what comes up run the extension. What do you think about the reviews here in the top 10, Becky? So, so we're, we're looking to get under 100. Under 100, the they, they're all definitely under 100 bar one. Yeah, um, that's actually pretty good. And that one's only just over 100, yeah. about 124. So that one's actually, that's pretty good. Then um, sales. You said under. We, we wanted at least 100, uh, no, at least 100 Minimum sales. Minimum of 100, yeah. So 
they're all definitely most average, of them uh, yeah over you've got the odd one that's yeah, the average Just here under. is 174 across that entire page. Yeah. Um, there's a few here that are a little bit low, but this one, yeah, it, it's not too bad. No. Then we've got price. Um, the, the top few here are a little bit below 800. Then we've got some that are a little bit more. The, it looks like the average price overall is about 800, so... That's probably okay. Maybe maybe the average price here is just a little bit lower than yeah. what we want. Yeah, no, I think the luggage... I think the luggage bag, it, it just had some stronger numbers. Do. Yeah. Yeah, um, which I guess like brings me to a good point is like, that's the whole point of, you know, using Jungle Scout or tools like that is that we want to use data to back up our decisions. I'll just try photo frame. So again, I'll just start very broad. Photo frame... Photo frames? Yeah. I'll just see what, what see happens what, with photo yeah. frames and then maybe we could like dive deeper into a niche. Straight away I can see that according to the the, the Chrome extension, it's been given a four opportunity score, um, which is immediately lower than the other two, mm -hmm. which is a little bit of an indication, but we, we do want to dive in deeper. Uh, so let's look at, okay, we'll look at the reviews in the sort of top 10 here. Um, for the most part, they're like all pretty low. They're all mostly below uh, 100. You've got like two, but... There's there's I two there that are, that are above. Um, but yeah, 252, that's starting to get a little bit high. Mm. But now let's have a look at the sales and we'll see that... Mm, oh, there's, there's three there that are... Well, uh, three there that are quite low. We won't worry too much about these ones because they're sponsored products. They're not organically ranked on this page, so we just want to look at the organic ones. Um, got two listings with 200 uh, sales a month, which is really good. But then the next few drop off to less than 100. Then these are around 100. Um, it's, yeah, maybe it, it's like maybe okay. If we look at the average monthly sales overall on this top page, it is 82, so. We were hoping for 100. Mm. <clears throat> So that one is a little bit low overall. Yeah. I think we've got some stronger products previously. Yeah. Uh, now, the question is, it's like we could dive deeper into the photo frame niche and kind of go like um, eight by 12 inch mm. photo frames or, or something a bit more specific. But I would tend to say that if the, the most broad keyword like photo frames, um, you know, doesn't have many sales or doesn't have enough sales and so forth, then I think by going in deeper, we, it, it's going to get even worse. So I would probably just discard it for now. So the luggage bag. Yeah, I think the luggage bag is probably the winner for today. Um, and yeah, so I, I hope you guys out there have got some value from my really quick breakdown. I, I certainly wouldn't recommend going out and trying to find a product in five no, minutes. It's definitely a challenge. It's, it was definitely a challenge. <laughs> we hope you found that fun mm. and interesting. Yeah, it's definitely interesting on my part. Don't it know was. You, but, um, <laughs> <laughs> you can calm down now. But, um, remember to leave your filter recommendations for the next product challenge in the comments below. Let us know what you want us to have a look at. And remember to like and subscribe, check out our other videos. And we'll Silly. see you in the next product challenge. We shall, see you guys. <laughs>